So the tame grouse is a unique phenomenon that occurs in the spring. The tame grouse is not actually tame at all. This is a wild Pennsylvania rough grouse, our state bird. He's never been handled by people. He was not raised by people or fed. It is a wild bird exhibiting what we call tame grouse behavior. Some people think they're drunk on Barry, that's one of the old tales. The other theory about these tame birds is that they're a genetic throwback to the old pre-settlement genetics of grouse. Uh, if you read the settler accounts, rough grouse was a much more docile, calmer bird. However, this bird is not being friendly, as friendly as he may appear. Um, He's actually telling me to get out of his territory. One theory behind the tame grouse behavior <laughs> is that they are being hyper-territorial. And if I come into the territory and do anything that sounds like I might be a drumming grouse, I can elicit this hyper-territorial response. This is his spring breeding territory, and we've intruded. And he's letting us know that he objects. This is a male grouse. You can tell that really by the proportion of the body. You see the length of the neck and the length of the tail uh, are in a nice proportion to the body itself. If this were a hen, the neck would be shorter, the tail would be shorter, giving her more of a plump appearance. So this is a fine specimen of a Pennsylvania rough grouse. If you're fortunate enough to come across one of these tame grouse, enjoy it while it lasts. It usually only lasts a few weeks during the peak breeding season. And often these birds do not live very long because they're a little too brave for their own good. It is mid-April, the hens are laying eggs right now. They're putting eggs in the nest. They'll be incubating within two to three weeks. So he still has to maintain his turf and, uh, and that's what he's doing here now. So we won't stay that long. We won't keep him agitated for too long, but it is really a unique experience if you're in the springtime woods. We hear probably four or five of these accounts each spring, uh, so it's not common in Pennsylvania. If you are lucky enough to come across one, enjoy it while it lasts. Usually only lasts a few weeks, and when the hormones fade, the birds fade back into the forest. Do you want me to keep talking? I know, I feel like. I feel like he's going to attack my head at it. <laughs> <He's> like... <laughs> yeah. Oh, the hell. Okay. 